Who Will Comfort Toffel, A Tale of Moomin Valley, by Tove Jansen is a delicate exploration of loneliness, fear, and the yearning for connection. In this story, Jansen introduces the character of Toffel, a small, timid creature who feels utterly alone in the world. He is so afraid of everything that he isolates himself from others, wandering through the Moomin Valley without ever reaching out. The narrative captures Toffel's emotional state with lyrical prose and whimsical yet melancholic illustrations that convey his internal landscape. Toffel's journey is one of self-discovery and courage. His fear manifests in every step he takes, and he avoids others out of a deep-seated insecurity that they may not like him or that he doesn't belong. As he walks through the valley, he witnesses the lives of others who are joyful and connected, but he feels even more distanced from their happiness. His feelings of alienation are emphasized in the way Jansen draws the world around him, expansive and beautiful but also filled with shadows, where Toffel remains on the fringes, unable to partake in the warmth and light. What makes Toffel's story particularly poignant is the presence of another character, Miffel, who is also lonely and afraid. Though Toffel doesn't realize it at first, Miffel is experiencing the same emotions he is, fear, loneliness, and a longing for comfort. Miffel sends out a cry for help, a letter asking for someone to come to her aid. When Toffel stumbles upon this letter, it becomes the catalyst for his transformation. For the first time, Toffel sees a purpose beyond his own fear. The realization that someone else is in need, someone who feels just as he does, propels him to act. The act of comforting another becomes the key to Toffel's growth. His fear doesn't disappear entirely but he begins to find strength in the idea that he can be the one to offer comfort. It's a profound message about empathy and the healing power of connection, how in reaching out to others, one can also find solace for themselves. As Toffel moves toward Miffel, the world around him brightens, reflecting his internal shift from fear to courage. Jansen's use of color and shadow is subtle but effective in illustrating this emotional change. The dark, Foreboding tones of earlier pages give way to more open and inviting landscapes as Toffel takes steps toward connection. The conclusion of the story is simple yet powerful. When Toffel finally reaches Miffel, he not only finds someone who shares his fears but also someone who welcomes him. Their meeting is tender, and it affirms that both characters needed each other to overcome their isolation. The act of comforting, in this case, becomes reciprocal, Toffel's journey to comfort Miffel results in him being comforted as well. This mutual comfort is at the heart of Jansen's message, suggesting that it is in human, or, in this case, creature, connection that true solace is found. Jansen's ability to weave this deep emotional theme into a simple narrative makes, who will comfort Toffel, resonate with readers of all ages. The book is accessible as a children's story with its gentle rhymes and imaginative illustrations, but it also holds profound insights into the human condition. The themes of loneliness, fear, and the transformative power of empathy are universal, and they are presented in a way that invites readers to reflect on their own experiences of connection and isolation. Ultimately, Who Will Comfort Toffel is a tale of hope. Through Toffel's journey, Jansen suggests that while fear and loneliness may be part of life, they are not insurmountable. The courage to reach out, to care for another, and to allow oneself to be cared for is what leads to comfort and companionship. The story is a reminder that in the act of comforting others, we often find the comfort we seek for ourselves.